Slow dancing, huh? Could it be there's really a place where no one wants to kill us? I handpicked it myself. We'll be safe. Are we sure it's wise to leave Scorpio in control of the bridge? Got the ship locked down. She can't go anywhere without my approval. I hope you're right. So, why this world? Remote, unsettled, and strong in the Force. But unlike Korriban or Tython, Odessan is altogether balanced. How did you find it? I've always had a strong affinity with the Force. It's what set me on this path to begin with. Led me to forge a certain alliance all those years ago. With the Republic? I meant with you. Here we are. This is your new alliance. Not my alliance. We're all in this together. That may well be, but they need someone to rally behind. Someone to motivate them. Kept myself from flushing Senya out of the airlock at least five times because of you. You've got a certain way. Show them what you're made of. everyone's attention. The galaxy as we knew it is gone. The institutions we have fallen. But we can't let that be a source of panic or defeat. We have an opportunity to build something together. An alliance each of us can be vested in. share the same ideologies but every one of you is here because you believe we can transcend our differences not fail. Like what you done with the place? Theron Sean. Hadn't seen you in a while. Wasn't sure you'd remember me. I take it Lana has been putting your skills to good use. She hasn't got me tortured by the enemy even once. In a long 
five years. Feels like everything's changed. Why don't you get me up to speed? I will. But before we dig into the big stuff, I've got something for you. You found my people? No luck so far, but... Needs work! A lot of work! When you have a moment, it's time for that official stuff. I'll be inside. To old friends and new allies. I'll drink to the second part. What's she saying? I think she says she'd rather be hunting instead of drinking. Yes. <laughs> Yes! But I am gonna do both. Do you even recall the last time we relaxed? I can. It was 2.6 million years ago, and Senya was still a jerk. Don't you think I was going to sing for you all tonight? You were what? Ah, oh, come on. I have got to hear this. Too late now. Saren, you can't let the weight of the galaxy rest on your shoulders all the time. Isn't that why you talked me into coming here? to lighten your load? I brought you here because you're good. Hey, look who it is. Don't worry, didn't really start without you. Yes, we've only just begun. I wasn't sure you'd attend. A chance to unwind after what we've been through is exactly what we need. You are exactly correct. Now get this guy to cheer up. I'm reasonably cheery. I'm joining in. And now, you are too. I was hoping to have a talk with one of you first. Oh? And who might that be? Come on, Theron. Let's catch up. You got it. Is there any food? Or did you eat at all? Hey, I mean, I probably did, but come on. And with the way everything changed, the SIS didn't feel right for me anymore, so I walked away. Kept up with my contacts, pretty much did what I was already doing, just not for the Republic. Not for anything. Against the cool. What about your mother? The Grandmaster? You know, the Jedi Order got scattered, plucked apart, and she decided to... go somewhere. Didn't say where. No one's heard from her, as far as I know. And I guess Law has filled you in on the rest. I want you to know that I'll do everything I can to keep things running smoothly around here. I don't doubt it, Theron. Oh, you got all these people to rally behind you. That was the hard part. What do you say we get back out there? Maybe there's more food. I was hoping to have a talk with one of you first. Oh? And who might that be? Not to tear you away from the party, cough. Already ate all the food. I'm good. He really did eat all the food, didn't he? Imagine if he was hiding out with us on Rishi. Better than Jakaro. Fair point, actually. If this is about the gravestone, you've got nothing to worry about. She's coming together. Scorpio's clued me into all kinds of needs and requirements. Think there's a lot she's holding back still, but I'm not about to press her. A lot of resources needed to get everything in ship shape. We'll make it. We have to make it. We'll need every asset we can muster to stop Arkin. He's tougher than I gave him credit for. Could be more powerful than his father. In a way, though, it doesn't worry me. When I first realized that was the gravestone in the swamp, I knew, you know? There had to be a reason I found her. I was meant to find that ship, and so were you. Two of us, same course heading. I think we can agree not everyone in this camp shares our goals. Been through a lot of hell with lots of folks. I know what can happen when someone's in it for themselves. I'll keep an eye out. We're gonna do all right, Outlander. Just as soon as I find something to snack on. You gonna have a drink with us, or what? I was hoping to have a talk with one of you first. Oh? And who might that be? Lana. Spare a moment? Of course. 
So, I think I'll go. Yeah. Yeah, of course. See you later. Yep. It's quite something, isn't it? So much more than the last alliance we formed. What I suspected when we aligned with Theron, Satil, and Darth Maul has borne out. I may have initiated events, but they would never have coalesced without you. I should be dead inside a metal tomb right now. You were determined to break me out. No, that's not... The truth was right in front of me, but I didn't want to believe it. I thought you were the only one to stop Arkham simply due to your capabilities, but now I see. This is destiny. Your destiny. It goes against everything I know to be true, but it's there. It's real. Maybe it's real. Maybe it isn't. What matters are the choices we make. And who we make those choices with? Nothing's more important. Are you kidding me? Look at my serious face. Hmm? You tell me if I'm lying. Oh, man. Such a Lana thing to do. I know, isn't it? What are you two discussing? Nothing. Definitely not anything about any abductions on Rishi. Nice to see you two could bond over something. Hey, have you seen Senya? Has anyone seen Senya? Koth, she's not hunting you anymore. You're going to have to trust her eventually. I thought this was supposed to be a celebration. Sorry for bringing it up. Doesn't look like there's much celebrating anyway. Crew needs to be back to work in an hour. That should be fun. I need to schedule some meetings. Reminds me of my advisor days. Thanks. All of you. It means a lot that you're here. Likewise, Outlander. Tora, Len, let's go, you miserable lightweights. Oh, shut up! you know. People from all over the galaxy want to stand behind you. That can't be what you were out here contemplating. It is, in a way. I was thinking how so many Scions followed Heskel. He would have them die as he did because their deaths were foreseen. Their visions provide great insight, but they're not infallible. Reminds me of the Heralds of Zildrog. There's another leader who paid for his certainty. Say what you will about Valkorion, but he at least considered the viewpoints of others. He listened to me. Most of the time. He didn't... He would never have done what... What... Arkin... What is it? I told you before that Arkin had a brother, Axon. They were inseparable until his death. Valen told me during our fight. Arkin murdered Vixen, his own brother. Maybe if I had raised him... Your fight with Valen. What happened? What she had to say, it struck me down to my core. Paralyzed me. She slipped away. Now, more than ever, I realize my children must be stopped, and that I have to make peace with the choices I've made. Whatever you've done to get here, I hope you can do the same. She raises a good question. How do you look back on your path to this moment? I made the decisions I felt were right. That's about all any of us can ever do. A life without regret is a life well lived. Though I suppose it remains to be seen whether you will ultimately succeed. Personally, I see you defeating Arkham. 
others on this world disagree. What does that mean? Who disagrees? You will learn soon enough. the only one. After I told Mother that you killed Vaxen, she probably wants your head. But it's not a problem. You have the throne, the fleet, this whole empire. You are as safe from her as can be. I wish Vaxen could be here now. Let's see, I was right to challenge Father. Imagine it. The three of us ruling this empire as it was meant to be ruled. I'd like it if Vaxen were here too. What? That's no longer possible. Doesn't matter. Father has a new favorite. He wants the Outlander to take all of this from you. I'll die before I let that happen to us. Of course you will. What is all this? It's your first official speech as Alliance Commander. I'll have to thank everyone for their vote of confidence. There was no vote, no meetings, no debates. It's simply the way it is. The way it's been since the day you arrived. Everyone knows it, it's just official now. I thought you hated titles. I hate having one, but I do love granting them. They're looking to you to guide them to greatness as only you can. Take them there. All of us here, we know about loss, don't we? We've lost loved ones, friends. We've been beaten down time and again. Our lives have been taken from us. It almost feels like our destiny. But not one of you has given up. You've stuck it out through your losses. You've come together to build, to create, to fight. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Working together, the galaxy won't have to live under the threat of a tyrant. Together, we will remove Arkhan from the throne and we will prevail. so far. Indeed, I have. They still have far to go, but at this rate they could one day pose a challenge to the Eternal Empire. Perhaps. A pity so many of them will have to die. <laughs> 